In order to locate the millions of landmarks on Earth, the Earth is divided into horizontal lines of latitude and vertical lines of longitude. Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. Lines of latitude are always read first. They're also called parallels. Lines of latitude are horizontal lines that measure north and south. Lines of latitude are about 69 miles apart from one another, or 110 kilometers. Each degree is divided into 60 minutes, and each minute is divided into 60 seconds. There are 3,600 seconds in a degree. The starting point is the equator found at zero degrees. The northern hemisphere in this picture is above the equator, and the southern hemisphere is below the equator. The Tropic of Cancer is found at roughly 23.5 degrees north, and the Tropic of Capricorn is found at roughly 23.5 degrees south. Between these two measurements, it's called the tropics. The North Pole is found at 90 degrees north, the Arctic Circle is found at 66.5 degrees north, and on the other hand, the South Pole is found at 90 degrees south, and the Antarctica Circle is found at 66.5 degrees south. Lines of longitude are also known as meridians, and they're vertical lines that measure east and west. The distance between these lines vary, but they are divided into minutes and seconds, just like lines of latitude. The starting point is the prime meridian, and it's found at zero degrees, and it passes through Greenwich, which is near London. If north is at the top, then to the left of the prime meridian is west, and to the right is east. You can use latitude and longitude to pinpoint any location on Earth. For example, Old Faithful is located at latitude 44 degrees, 27 minutes, 37.7 seconds north, and a longitude of 110 degrees, 49 minutes, 41.27 seconds west. Thanks for watching, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.